Hi, this is Trina Menzi with uh, mrsmenzi.blogspot.com and today I'm showing you drag to target answer reveal strategy. I have here a um, coordinate grid and I'm going to lock it in place. Now I'm going to grab my line drawing tool and indicate the answer that I've, I've posed to of a question that I've posed to the students and I'll, I'll draw that um, figure there. Now I'm going to go to gallery and I will find a uh, target. And we could use some icons for the target. I like this one. I use it on occasion. So then I'm going to put this one here. And what I do, oops, I just drew another line. No problem. I'm just going to delete that really quick. So what I want to do now is I'm going to lock this one in place. And I'm going to place this one right over it. And I'm going to put bring to front just so it's on the front. And I click it. Then I hold the shift key down and I click the other object. And now I could use control G, the keyboard shortcut, or click the drop down and tell it grouping group. And now when I click to move this, I can move it off to the side. You could propose you, you could pose the question to the student. Um, they could come up, grab a marker, and draw what they think the right answer is. And then you could drag the answer key to target and see how close they were. And that's a great way for the students to get immediate feedback. And they're up and they're moving around. And it reinforces um, teaching strategy and class participation, keeps the students involved. Thank you very much. I hope you found this very helpful. And again, I am Trina Menzi from mrsmenzi.blogspot.com. If you have additional questions, please feel free to email me or uh, let me know how I could help. Thank you.